In 2012, uh, Ghana passed the Mental Health Act, and this act uh, is aimed at ensuring that we have a new system of uh, mental health here in Ghana. And after that, what really have we do? Have we done uh, with respect to uh, civil society's contributions and individuals uh, in, in ensuring that we, you know, eradicate or reduce the stigma associated with mental health? here in Ghana. Uh, I'm joined in the studio by Nanabana Koko Ado uh, from the Mental Health Society of Ghana. She's here to talk about Time to Talk Day, yeah. the very first edition of Time to Talk Day. What is Time to Talk Day? Okay, so mm -hmm. Time to Talk Day is a day. It's originated from the UK, from Time to Change organization. Mm -hmm. And it's a day set a time to make people feel more comfortable, be more open when it comes to mental health issues. So you would want to be able to have an everyday conversation and include mental health with your friend, with your colleagues, uh, with when you go on a date or you are stuck in traffic or you are at the football pitch, you should be able like tips on how to easily talk about your mental health. How do I even know I have a mental health situation and then to talk about it? For okay, instance. so yeah. for that, I'm yeah. going to direct you to our website, okay. www.itcouldbeyou.com.gh. Mm -hmm. It could be you. Yeah, it could be you.com.gh. Okay. Mm -hmm. And you can read more mm -hmm. about it. Mm -hmm. You mm -hmm. can get an in-depth mm -hmm. knowledge, mm -hmm. you know, how to f figure out if you are going through stress mm -hmm. or a mental health problem. It could be yeah. you.com. Yeah. Okay, so, so uh, time to talk day 2020. How is it helping to reduce the stigma around mental health patients here in Ghana? Yes, so we are going to give people tips on how to um, talk to people when it comes to mental health. Mm -hmm. Some of the tips are you just have to ask. Mm -hmm. If you don't ask, you would not know. Right. You have to ask. You have to be patient when you ask the person the question. Mm -hmm. And then you should not... Um, if the person discloses anything to you, don't change how you relate with them. Mm -hmm. But sometimes it comes naturally. It's like someone has a mental problem and then the person is talking yeah, to so you already. You have, you, this, have to you, know? you have to groom yourself <laughs> yeah. because once you tell me you have a mental health problem mm -hmm. in life, then, then like I'm stigmatizing you yeah, and stereotyping yeah. in some form. Yeah. You know, if somebody has diabetes or a heart condition, mm -hmm. you don't give that same reaction. That shows that we are lacking education. We are lacking um, the knowledge about mental health problems. Mm -hmm. That is why stigma is there. That is mm -hmm. why people are discriminated. Mm -hmm. But it shouldn't be so mm -hmm. because they don't call for the mental health condition. It's, you know, it comes, is a naturally occurring thing mm -hmm. like diabetes or mm -hmm. a heart condition. So, so they what are some of the things that will be happening tomorrow? Okay. Uh, with regards to the mental, the time so, to talk day. Yeah, so tomorrow, uh -huh. Mental mm -hmm. Health Society of Ghana Champions, we are going to be at the Accra Mall Footbridge. Okay. The traffic is terrible this morning. And mm -hmm. tomorrow, I'm happy that there will be more traffic. So, so, so okay. after work, because we'll be of the there. Event. Okay. Because of the event. Okay. So... Uh, we are going with the would you rather game. So would, would you, you rather be stuck in traffic yeah. or you talk to like a friend about his Okay, so I see, I see, you see this year, the time to talk is using the would you rather, rather game. So what, 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 what is that supposed so to mean? So would you, would you rather be, say, would you rather be that or that? So this, what we are picking is, um, would you rather be stuck in a car? traffic under the hot stand or you talk to a friend who is trapped in their feelings mm -hmm. so we'll be at the foot's bridge we'll be giving um people conversation starters mm -hmm. where you know uh, a, a, an exercise book with a mental health message or a badge like what i'm wearing let's talk Beautiful about mental badge. health yeah so when you see the person wearing it was it spark, what's that and it was okay. spark a conversation yeah. about mental oh nowadays I, I feel stressed i think i'm going to see a psychologist or maybe because of my stress i've i've taken on some exercise or this relationship is bad for me because it's affecting my mental health. Mm -hmm. You know, just to have normal conversations. Mm -hmm. You might not even mention the word mental health, but you know, you mm -hmm. feeling stress, you talking to because there are people who don't know the difference between depression mm -hmm. and stress mm -hmm. that is related to mental health. You see that, so they they are, they are wondering where am I? Where do I belong? There are severe mental health conditions, mm -hmm. maybe bipolar schizophrenia and all those ones and everybody has mental health so just as you have a mental health it could you know be good or bad at some times it might not necessarily mean that you have the, a disease but 
your your mental health might not be at a great place mm -hmm. so we are letting you that you know pay attention to your mental health mm -hmm. so that it doesn't get to the worst stage mm -hmm. that the same way that you are taking care of you know what you are eating mm -hmm. uh, you're having your skincare routine it's the same way that you have to pay attention to your, your mental health. How do health. I pay attention to my mental health? So, like, yeah, so um, in a situation where maybe you you are always feeling stressed. Okay. You are always feeling anxious about situations. Mm -hmm. Have you stopped to ask yourself, how can I reduce the stress? Mm -hmm. How can I reduce this anxiety? Mm -hmm. Or I'm in this relationship. I'm always feeling sad. I'm always crying. What can I do to change it to make me feel stable? Mm -hmm. So these are the questions that some people hardly ask themselves, but we're encouraging you to have conversations about it. Mm -hmm. And then when you come, you are able to come to the footbridge. We have uh, materials on, um, we'll signpost you to maybe mm -hmm. where you can get professional help if you need that. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's just you opening up to somebody mm -hmm. you trust mm -hmm. and feel comfortable with. So you have health professionals among you. Do you have some people with mental health yes, problems? Yes, so who? at the footbridge, okay is mm -hmm. going to be purely mental health champions mm -hmm. these are people who have lived experience of mental health problems mm -hmm. and they have recovered and they are sharing their story educating people mm -hmm. so those are the people that are going to be there but if you need professional services we have the list of the uh, uh, reputable um mental health services in ghana mm -hmm. yeah whether it's call service or you actually want to go to uh, a physical facility to mm -hmm. ascertain whether your mental health is good or not so you are having a lot of people so are calling for people to come free right yes it's yes free it's, it's part, free yeah. just as mm -hmm. you're walking over mm -hmm. the bridge mm -hmm. pass by pick up a mental health uh, conversation starter mm -hmm. so when you go home and you're not comfortable to me just drop the books and your child will, what book is this yeah and they go like oh um it's you know encouraging us to talk more about mental health um how are you doing how so are a you? few steps when your child comes out from school you could ask you could how was ask, your day yes. a lot of children you know, are depressed right a lot of people uh, children are having suicidal thoughts mm -hmm. but you don't even know how to start the conversation about that mm -hmm. because you don't want to uh uh, look a certain way so a we are just way, trying yeah. to make conversations about mental more open demystify yeah demystify yeah. it more everybody should feel mm -hmm. comfortable talking mm -hmm. about it mm -hmm. so um to get more tips you can mm -hmm. follow us at mm -hmm. mesoc mm -hmm. and that's go on instagram right. on twitter is at mesoc right. so you get more tips on what to do on social media and that yeah. nana yeah. bena koko ado is with from the mental health society of ghana and she's talking about time to talk day it's happening tomorrow the very first edition it's happening at the Cramall. Yeah. Uh, uh, the footbridge the from foot, 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. From yeah. 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. So join them and let's know what your state is and let's demystify. Let's find a way to break the stigma yeah. around mental health patients.